All right, guys, let's talk about tricep training. Now, the tricep, the back of the arm, makes up a majority of the size of the upper arm. So if you're trying to get big, muscular-looking arms, you definitely can't neglect the triceps. And for you girls out there that want those sculpted arms, well, when you're relaxed, it's the most visible muscle of the upper arm. So it's an important muscle to work on and develop. Now, there's a lot of different exercises you could do for the triceps. Uh, a lot of them focus on hand placement, like supinated grip, pull down, press downs, or pronated grip, or neutral grip, and there's lots of exercises. Look, here's the deal. The triceps really don't do anything with the hand. They don't supinate or pronate the hand. That's, that's the job of the bicep and some other muscles in the upper arm. The tricep really just extends the elbow. Now, if you're gonna pick a combination of exercises to really develop your triceps effectively, what you wanna focus on isn't hand placement as much as elbow placement. And this is because one of the heads of the tricep, the long head, which is the, the, this big part back here, attaches at the shoulder blade, at the scapula. And so when my arm is at my side and I do an exercise, it shortens the muscle, or at least it's in a shortened position. As I move my elbow up and eventually having it above my head, the long head is actually stretched out. And so what you wanna do is you wanna pick exercises that work the triceps in different elbow positions. The three main ones being elbows at your side, elbows in front of you, and elbow overhead. So what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna show you the three exercises you need to have in your tricep training routine to develop amazing triceps. Okay, so the first exercise I'm gonna show you is good old fashioned parallel bar dips. Now this is an exercise, like I said, that keeps the arms kind of at your side. So we're gonna start with that angle. It's also a compound movement. That means that I'm gonna be working more than one joint. So it's not an isolation tricep exercise. I'm actually using my shoulders and my chest a little bit. So I like to start my clients with a heavy compound tricep movement where the triceps are, or the elbows are by their sides. Dips, one of the best exercises you can do. Let me show you guys how to do this. So I've got a relatively wide grip here at the front, at the, at the front of the bars. I want you to go a little bit more narrow. It's gonna give you more of a tricep focus. You wanna grab onto the bars, you wanna jump into position. If you're not strong enough to do so, you can step up on a step, and they do have tricep assisted uh, machines that give you a little bit of assistance. So I'm gonna press myself up. You wanna have a tight grip on the bar, nice tight core. I like to bend my knees a little bit. You wanna lower your body, nice and controlled, and press yourself up. Really focus on the squeeze at the top of the exercise, okay? That is your elbow at your side tricep exercise. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna move the elbow up and do another exercise now where the elbow is placed in front of my body. Best exercise to do that is good old fashioned skull crushers. I'm gonna be using these dumbbells right here. Now you can do this with the barbell as well. I actually prefer dumbbells. It's a little bit harder to balance. I, I feel like I get a better workout. So what you wanna do is you wanna get a couple dumbbells and you wanna lay back on your back and you want your arms in this kind of starting position. Neutral grip, meaning my hands are facing each other, arms straight up. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna bend your elbows so my arms stay fixed. You wanna bend your elbows so the dumbbells come either next to your head or right behind your head and then press them all the way up, squeeze the triceps and then repeat. Bend just at the elbows, all the way down, come up, and squeeze. Again, you'll notice that the, the bottom of my arm isn't swinging, it's in this fixed position. Now the third exercise, so we did one with the elbow at my side, right, with the dips. We've done one with the elbow in front of me with the skull crusher. Now let's do an exercise where the elbow is up above my head. And with that, I'm gonna do good old fashioned overhead tricep extension. So I'm gonna take a dumbbell, I want you to grab it by the bell, one hand on top of the other, arms straight up, and you're just gonna bend at the elbows, bring the dumbbell behind your head, and then extend all the way up and squeeze the triceps. Again, come down, all the way up and squeeze. Now those three exercises will effectively hit the tricep from three different elbow positions, three different lengths of the long head of the tricep. You'll get a great pump, you may get sore, but these com this combination right here I found to be extremely effective. If you have any questions about these exercises or anything else, Put it in the comments below this video. I'll visit periodically to try to answer those for you. Also, share this video with your friends who you think may benefit from some of this information and subscribe to our channel. And there's a little bell thing at the top, this little signal thing. Click on that so you get notifications every time we post a new video.